here's a governance idea I'd like to tee up for debate. The more disruptive and labor-intensive corporate board meetings are for company staff, the more likely that the board is getting its governance role wrong. I know there are some good counter-arguments to this idea. A board of directors is a unique entity in the company with unique needs. Too often, these are treated as administrative afterthoughts. But I still maintain that this test gives us a measure of how well your board is doing its job. You're all familiar with the drill at most organizations in preparing for the board meeting. Everyone's busy and they make sure to look busy. Getting together reports and briefings, presentations, donuts, notepads, so on. This is a high stakes game. No one wants to be the staffer who fumbles board meeting day. Regular business uh, gets pushed aside and schedules are turned upside down for the big event. Though at least after the meeting, there should be some of those leftover donuts in the break room. Well, here are the problems with this routine. First, it's obviously disruptive to the regular flow of business and getting things done at the company. The idea that preparing a needed bid quote for a proposal or making a deadline needs to be pushed off because of the board meeting should give everyone pause. And also, think about those one-off presentations, reports, and briefings that you're developing just for the board meeting. The more material is customized and targeted to a board, the more removed it becomes from actual operations. It's more likely the daily company reality is being homogenized and sometimes dumbed down to make it easily digestible. This not only distances the board from company reality, but it shows contempt for their abilities. All this work and disruption for the board meeting shows another imbalance, and this one reflects on the board itself. The more prep work staff must do, the less prep work board members themselves may be doing. As a director, you should be devoting an hour or so at least to reviewing material in the board book for each hour spent in the board meetings. But you should also put in at least that amount of time on your own swatting on the company, on its website, news, online image, analyst reports, financials, competitors, and your own uh, resource contacts. Maybe staff should put less effort into doing a job that should be yours as an effective director. I'm Ralph Ward from the boardroom for November.